Hisense has officially launched their new displays for 2020. Um, they showed it at CES, but it's official now. It's now available and they are going to support a lot of, a lot of formats out there from the video formats to the audio formats. Uh, their TV would be su supporting the high dynamic range 10 format plus uh, it will support HDR10 plus format which uh, was kind of like a feature Samsung brought out a couple of years ago and um, they will support Dolby Vision as well which is fantastic they are supporting all the top of the line high dynamic range formats they will also support the coding of Dolby Atmos now their flagship is going to be called uh, the ULED uh, called the model number is the U8QF weird weird name to be honest very weird name uh, it will be available in 55 inch 65 inch uh, sizes technically now um the peak brightness would i think it should be over almost 2000 uh, it, it should be it should be quite bright uh, i have not checked the the brightness performance for this but it should be very it should be a very bright because it's actually quantum uh dots technology now um the the uh flagship the u8 8 qf uh it is going to be able to support all um the dynamic range so you'll still be able to get hlg with this and um it's it's it, it it's full array dimming even though it's quantum dot so it will be able to give you great blacks which almost will be able to compete with OLED. Uh, I am not very sure how whether it will perform very well in the video department but all I can say is gonna come with a sound bar and actually an inbuilt sound system that is tuned by JBL and you will get good sound uh, you will get good sound from this setup it's gonna have inbuilt apps um, like Netflix Amazon uh, Rok Rok Content TV YouTube and um, it is looking very good now the other model that they will launch is the U7 QF uh, which is the next in line to their flagship U U8 uh, which will be available in 50 inch 55 inch 65 inch and um, it is definitely below the U8 QF um, the refresh rate for this one is 60 Hertz so it will not be very good for gaming uh, the other flagship which is the U8 QF will come with a 120 Hertz refresh rate um, it's looking quite good now now every other lower model that they launched would just complement this series but right now all you need to know is that these new displays will cover the dynamic range formats and they are not going to be too expensive and pre-orders will probably be going on right now so if you really want to go to get this i will drop a link to hisense website you could go um pick it up on their website be sure to follow on social media subscribe to our channel like our content and i'll see you guys next time